Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we are checking out the April update in Fashion Dreamer. I've been so excited for this one. I didn't know it was dropping until literally last night because they don't communicate that well. But we have a bunch of new outfits. We have a bunch of new items for the new fair update. And the theme is going to be like future fair. And the items look so, so good. So let's go check out all of our new items first. Also, they are doing a collaboration with this Japanese earphone brands, which look like little hearts in your ear, which we got free patterns for. I'm really hoping that's not a limited one, but I guess we shall see. So starting off, we have four new items in the gacha. Each gacha has its own new one. I don't feel like going to every one of them, but they all have a new leopard print out item. So as you can see, it has the leopard print fedora right here, which mm, I don't know, girl. It's okay, I guess. I'm not the biggest fan of fedora. Fun has leopard print boots. Act has leopard print pants, which I really, 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 really want because that in hot pink will go do numbers. It will do numbers. And then in hope, we have a leopard print open collar shirt. So just check those out if you want to see any new leopard print items. And there we have the earrings. It's part of the earbud collaboration accessory. We get three, so that's like okay for the magazine collab with the t shirts and stuff. We also got three each, so I guess I'm okay with that. The fair will also be two each, which is really nice that I think they're gonna just keep that in at this point. Now we're gonna go over all the other blueprints i will have it down below what rank you unlock what but the first one we're having here is the striped crop tank top we had this one in the last update but this one i guess is striped which is kind of cute i guess i like it let's unlock it too as a little detail i like it it comes with a necklace those are often my favorite then our second one is right here it is the frilled color hound's tooth print vest with ribbon which there's a lot going on it's 100 keys i don't think it's that cute right now so i'm just gonna leave that then we have a beat type item it's striped tee with shirt tied over the shoulder so i don't know if it really looks like shirt or if it's like printed on but this is what we have and then we have the multicolored crop jean jacket which uh, yes i will be buying i really like the jean jacket design and this one has like more this doesn't look like stitches from animal crossing right this is really cute and this one is a type a then we have the gingham check dress with crop blouse which it's okay i don't think it's my style but if you go for like the gothic vibe especially with like black and red i think this one will be really cute but i am pretty Pretty sure it's also like pattern version of this one which we got i think last update then we have the frilled houndstooth print straight jacket which matches the 100 key top that i just showed my head is covering it it's just like an a-line pencil skirt it doesn't look that interesting to me i don't know why it's so expensive yeah that's that one same as with another recolor we have the dotted mermaid skirt which we again got like two updates ago but this one is dotted i do not like dotted so i will be passing on this one also i've had a hard time styling the regular mermaid one so i don't think this one is happening for me then we have a really really good new one ribbon knee socks with hole design aren't these not so cute i've seen the recolors on the website in like pink and stuff love these these are really nice even with this pattern don't mind me if i already craft it i'll skip on the black and white one but i'll do like with pink right right i think that's cute we're doing that <laughs> i have to make a few more of these because i i haven't really been using that many socks and i feel like this is one that i use pretty often then our other b type item is shower sandals which is only five Five keys so i'm just gonna get it they're basically just flip-flops they're cute i wish there were more flip-flops maybe it gives me us some hope for maybe some summer updates with bikinis maybe one piece hmm? i don't care that'll be cute like a big floppy hat i really want a big floppy hat we also have a new headband which i will be getting this is the plaid hairband which has like such a cute pattern on it i love me a good hairband i feel like it always finishes the look for me so i'm just gonna make this like beige and white one right now and i'm gonna have like a bunch of different color versions i need to sort out my wardrobe so bad and that was it let me know what you thought of the new items i feel like it's kind of weak because most of them are just like prints on top of patterns that we already had but they are patterns that i would personally use so i'm not hating here now it's time to get into the future fair y'all does this not give major hatsune miku vibes the only thing is the headphones are connected to the hair so you will have to style them together but i don't hate it i also really 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 like the the a-type jacket i'm not even looking at the b-type but the a one is so cute i'm gonna make my character look like miku at the end of this because it's gonna be so good once again we're gonna get two of everything in the end last time there were two more volumes yeah there are 16 instead of 12 now so you will have to do a little bit more but i noticed last time that there wasn't that much styling in the beginning so we'll see how today is and how we are feeling this all right we have a lot of player muse quests here so let's go pick out someone here i'm really hoping we get some blue star items already oh this is 
cute. All right, so we have to like an item. So we're going to view it and let's get the dress because you can never have too many. Then we have to follow player met in a cocoon. So you do muse actions, this player, follow and unfollow. Their logo is really cute. And that one is also done. Then we have to make a, a look at for a player muse. I'm going to do her because she just has a, like a lower score. So maybe she wants some good outfits, you know? She said purple plaid. So we can use our new plaid headband, which you can't really see it that good, but it is really cute. Details, detail, right? So we have this one and I have some of these dresses. I made these for, I think my latest showroom. So that's why they're on the top here. So maybe we can just give her the whole look honestly skip the headband right this is really cute i made like a whole easter look at uh showroom on my stream like two weeks ago i think so i'm very excited to do a new showroom soon because i think there are also some items in here so we have this done oh an npc is following my showroom i don't want to do that all right next up we have to like an item with a blue star in the pop-up area so now let's see if there are some no lifers who already speed run the whole event because i want to get that jacket let's see oh we have the headphones too which i will pick up because i don't have that one yet to like one thing but i do want to check for everything else i don't want to hoard the clown dresses anymore i really need to stop hoarding the event items because i have too many i don't use them though i do think the clown dress is better than the uh, other one hmm, these items are not that great where is the good stuff uh oh it's b type yeah i kind of want to stop getting b type items i'm sorry but my storage is full i don't need dress up b types ever like sometimes i get requests for b type oh <gasps> look there is it oh my god we'll do the shoes too oh not that one yeah i got sometimes requests for b type but i don't style them myself i don't have a b type myself and i don't i don't know i don't have the storage for this if they're gonna expend it again and i'm like okay is this the same one it's not they look almost the same i have a black version too no one's done amigo color yet Ooh, we have some wings Ooh, these are cute i know i need to stop hoarding wings i know i know i know i know i know mm, do i like this one i'll just get them and i'll get rid of them by the time that my storage is full i think i have like 900 slots left i just need to be more careful here okay i'm kind of surprised about the lack of items or maybe i just don't know what they look like but i feel like i already out can know all these patterns there's nothing new okay so we have the first affair done and then we have the mishmet socks with guard <gasps> it even has band-aids on it i love asymmetric socks they're so cute Oh, this is one of my favorites. And then I think these are the B-type, so no, whatever. Those are cute, but wow, those are cute. Then next up, we have a new photo frame, which you will see <laughs> once I finish, I guess. And then the pose... I don't know how I feel about that one. Interesting. And five gotcha points, bingo tickets, whatever. Okay, we basically have to do the same thing, like an item worn by a player muse. Let's see. Is she wearing anything interesting? I guess the skirt is kind of cute. Take that one. Then like an item worn by a character muse, which should be this person, even though it's kind of boring what she's wearing. Eh. I'll take the shoes, I guess. I have to get rid of that someday. And then we have to send a stamp to an item marked with a blue star in the item box. So going to item box, selecting an item and then saying nice. Okay, so they're not the same. They look very similar. I prefer the purple one, I think. You know what? I might use my pattern if we don't find like a Miku themed one because I really want to look full hot to Miku. She can wear something like that, right? And then we have to make a look it for a player muse. So do I want to do the B type? Oh, really? Read anything long skirt? Cute. All right, let's listen to the request for ones. Let's see if I have a... Or actually, wait, I want to see what the new headphones look like because they're really cute. Where are they? Here they are. Oh, <laughs> the hairstyle doesn't help at all. Well, well, never mind then, I guess. Red long skirt. I don't even have any that look good. I absolutely hate... I should just get rid of these. I don't know why I keep them around. I'm saying emergencies. Look at this. Do you ever see me use some Minnie Mouse ass looking outfit? Nah, I don't even know why I keep this. We well, can do this long skirt though and then red shoes and then red tops just like sandwich the colors i guess so we'll just do loafers because it looked like her character was dressed up like an office lady so i want to think this is someone who's older who's playing this i mean we should kind of dress like that too not a double pattern though i don't hate this it's not the cutest but i don't really have this one in ready again why do i have like three four shades of pink for this one? i probably even have more colors because i'm using the color filter right now it just ugh, i don't need that right this uh, it's a little bit too bright. I don't know, man. This one's actually kind of cute. Let's do that. And then see if we have glasses. Does it make it look any better? Actually, it does. I was going to do headband, but I misclicked. But honestly, that's kind of a modest look. It's not really my style, but it's cute. I like it. Don't hate it. All right, there's that one done. And I think we've already done the whole Future Fair 2 already. Speeding this up today. 
All right, so as a reward in act, we have the cherries. It's a little bit too vibrant. I, again, it's the dots for me. I don't know. I feel like polka dots are so dated. I had a dress when I was super young like that, and I really loved it. But I, I haven't gone back to it. I, I wonder if it's... Ooh, wow. Is that wallpaper? Okay, wait. I know. I'm going to hide my camera for this. I think that's the wallpaper in the floor for the new showrooms. That is actually wild. That is going to be my new favorite. That is way better than the Alice one we got. <laughs> is that the last one we had? I think so. Okay, so these are not all showroom related by the looks of it. We can just go to someone's showroom and that'll be enough so let's choose this person again because we only have to do like one thing we don't have to visit like three showrooms so let's go in and then finish our quest all right first one already done go to someone's showroom oh it's kind of cute yeah look this is kind of okay looking but the flooring is not matching with what it came with i just think it looks better like this it didn't really match i feel like the one we're getting right now matches better together anyway go to someone's showroom send a like in someone's showroom just so say uh, i think i have to like an item so let's Let's go with um i don't think i have many color versions of this pants so we'll just do that and then next up send a stamp to a music made a showroom so press set r then say nice i think yes and then lastly follow music made a showroom so set r again profile and then follow and then in my case unfollow and that is already done we're speeding through this so by the looks of it because they've done this like twice in a row now so i'm gonna say this is probably the, the way they want to go with this game now is instead of the two or twelve fair levels they're gonna change the 16 now but they are making it a little bit easier because as you can see there was no styling involved in this whole volume but we did still get stuff but we still got a bunch of stuff futuristic wall yes that flooring is gonna get so much use out of this if you want to see me style the showroom which i will not be doing today it's going to be this saturday on youtube here live so make sure you check in if you want to see what my new showroom is going to look like it's going to be really good okay next up we have oh again my head is like in the wrong way we have the shorts i think that's for the a type and the b type pants i guess they're cute. It's like a tech wear or whatever you call that. Street tech. All right. Like an item worn by a character muse once again. Ugh, I don't like her look. I don't want to like that one. Let me see if there's anyone here. Because downstairs, downstairs are often like all B types. So maybe interesting look. Very interesting look. Let's see. Uh, I'll take these shoes, I guess. That's a character muse. Next up, like an item worn by a player muse. Let's see. Orange socks. I don't think I have those. <laughs> I'll take them. Send a stem to all items of coordinated look by a player so you press the whole look you press view outfit and then before zooming in you press set r and then say nice and that one is done and lastly we have to make a look it for a character muse so i guess we're we'll just do you i guess purple tones as per usual i don't really care about the mp series but you know what i feel like styling today because i haven't played this game in a minute because all i've been doing i've been playing a lot of animal crossing that that dlc is so so good i love love a saturday afternoon i'm not even playing it a saturday afternoon my boyfriend's playing animal crossing forced by me because he doesn't even like playing the styling rooms i have the best naps bro i'm out the moment that he enters the house and puts one thing down it's sleepy time it's so comforting i love it <laughs> all right this is like a simple little simple little look i don't know why the black ones are part of purple but i actually don't like the dark the dark shade let's just do this one yeah, a lot of animal crossing recently but there's like new items in here they show a look on the website when i checked yesterday and they had this really cute denim set with like a mini skirt which that mini skirt looks so good but i didn't see it anywhere so i don't know if it's like a future thing but once that mini skirt comes out it's over for y'all me the puffer jacket and the mini skirt is gonna be all i'm wearing dude i have definitely some favorite items in this game they're so good anyway sorry for my yapping <laughs> we have completed our next fair let's see we have our subculture style shorts with belt and our nylon cargo pants great and five gotcha tickets next up volume five we have a new background piece but this one is like spacey looks like it's in a little spaceship i wonder if they connect together just like the hard ones did in the last fair and just some keys and stuff we have to go to the pop-up area again i think i want to go to another cocoon i don't think it makes a difference in where i am let's go to act because it's like my second favorite but i i want to see if there's different items because i haven't logged in this game in like a hot minute and we just went to the showroom and i already saw a few items that i already liked before and i don't know why those never refresh for me because there's always items that always stay the same i often have that the right side of the pop-up area like 90 percent of the items will always be the same for me for whatever reason and i kind of hate that and it doesn't look like it's any different from the other place we 
just went. We have to like an item. What are we gonna get? Yeah, this is the same. I mean, we, I guess we can get the purple pants because I don't have that many. Because those are from the gacha as well. Oh, we have to send a stamp. We didn't have to get it. Okay, that's fine. Send a stamp. And then we have to style a character, a player, and send a stamp to a player, Mew. So I guess this is going to be our person for today. We sent a stamp and now let's style her. Light blue, anything dress cute. Mm, sure. I don't know if blue counts. Like if it's all shaded blue, probably. Light blue. This one is really cute. I really hope the style of fashion is going to be trendy again. Wait, no, 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 no. We're going to do this dress. We're going to do this dress. Oh, speaking of, if you weren't at the last live stream that we did on Fashion Dreamer, I actually pulled the dress. If you're still wondering, you missed that. I pulled it. You saw my character wear it, the orange one. I pulled it. I think I even pulled it twice, but I didn't use both blueprints. I am over the moon that they changed it because I finally have my dream dress like in seven or eight shades at this point. It is so cute. All right, we can do some ties. This is very blue, but I'm feeling very monochrome color today. We can do a little headband with the gingham, right? This is cute. Love the fit. I wish these like sweater type or t-shirt type dresses would work on me in real life, but because when I sit down, like it goes up like it doesn't look right on me or something with my body shape maybe look how cute it is in orange by the way i love my fit it looks so good anyway yeah haven't anyone seen t wear t-shirt dresses and actually look good in them <laughs> honestly but that's just me maybe but i saw one in the store they almost got it because they're just comfortable but they don't look good i don't know looks elegant Ugh, i hate elegant styling so i think i'm gonna skip this one because to me elegant just means like oh i'm going to the office right like this is like this looks elegant to me but you yeah <laughs> she agrees right no it's not for me that top is hideous that's so bad i definitely accepted that in fashion dreamer i do not want every item in the game because again i don't use like i would say a good quarter of them i think are really ugly and i would never use them so i think i'm gonna start learning to let that go Ooh, the jacket is cute oh but maybe we have to like the item for the next gotcha thingy dude this fit is fire that's so did I just say that? This fit is so cute. Ugh, ugh, I gave myself the ick there. That, ooh, why did I say that like that? Anyway, gosh. Next up, we have our frame is also in act. We have 50 E points and some keys. Perfect. Halfway done. Oh, no, not halfway done. Because there's 16 now. All right, we have the B-type jacket, I assume. 50K and five tickets. The tickets are kind of like, could have been a little bit more. I don't think it's enough. They're not really losing anything and giving us more tickets. I think five is a little bit too little. Okay, so like an item worn by a player muse, like an item worn by a character, follow muse to send feedback and make a uh, look it for a player muse. So I'm gonna take her jeans, the jacket for sure. I love this jacket, pants, and honestly, I'll take the shoes too. I haven't made that many versions of it yet, so I'll just, I'm, I'm feeling lazy here. So we'll just use other people's version. We have that done. Wait, let me like a character first. I'll style her, but oh shit, there she is again. She's not that special anymore now, but <laughs> like an item. I don't know. I guess I'll address it again. Hmm. Then follow Amuse to send feedback. So opening the profile, go to feedback and then saying your profile, follow. And that one is also done. And then lastly, we have to style a player muse. Blue anything cute. Okay, we're gonna we'll do like something really good because their outfit is really nice did i have any new stripper kind of stuff you know what maybe we should style the uh the jacket i kind of like this with the combat boots and then we can do some jeans or something oh, one of these new pairs i know this is not blue but i like it we can do this one it's a little bit more colorful all right this is not what they're asking for but we can we can do a little bit of interpretation here all right with a little hat i feel like the black and the white is too too much contrasty do you get what i mean sometimes people use the colors that they put the slider all the way down to zero 100 and i can see that and i don't like that but i guess it's just personal preference uh, maybe well streetwear often has like all loose clothing so i think this is good we'll send it on her way i don't think she's gonna like it oh she's not wearing a top i'm like why can i not confirm it let's do a black top yeah i don't think this is gonna be what they want but whatever it's cute and that is future fair number six seven done then we have our nylon jacket i don't really like it i think i like the other one but this one kind of gives like a little bit of like clown jacket vibes from the 80s i feel like my parents had something like that <laughs> i 
don't know. <gasps> wow, look at that. Wow, okay, so we have like a standee. I don't think you can put anything in it, but you can put like two mannequins, especially if like the special ones in front of it, like the shiny ones. And then a display, but it looks like planets. Oh, I'm so excited for my showroom. That's gonna be really good. All right, next up is gonna be all related to showrooms. We're gonna go to her showroom because her original outfit was like <laughs> kind of better than the one I made. So let's go see. Oh, she's super low level. I guess it doesn't really matter because she can get items from anywhere. Oh, well, I don't know what I was expecting. I don't, <laughs> I was expecting a little bit more than that, but at least it looks okay, right? So we already in the showroom, so that's the first one. I sent a like to someone's showroom. And, uh, I guess I'll take the shoes. Let's, oh, I already like the shoes. Uh, I guess I'll do, oh, I already have those two. Uh, I guess I'll do the purple top, okay? Send a stamp to an item displayed in someone's showroom. So once we're on here, oh, she didn't make these. Are these all items that she didn't make? Oh no, oh. Also cannot reach the back here. Unfortunately, we'll have to visit another showroom. All right, let's just go to the next person over. I'm scared that the lower levels are not gonna have any custom art. Right, let me find someone with a higher level. I'm sorry. I want to give it a chance, but if I'm gonna get stuck, oh, is this enough? Probably. All right, let's try this again. All right, this looks like a custom item. Said I like this someone's item in the showroom. I like this pattern too. Then follow me who created the item so through here. I think it's the same person. It wasn't. Okay, good. I have followed that one and then sent a stamp so we can say a nice. All right, that one is perfect. We are done with this one after a little trial and an arrow. Wait, this pants. Wait, they're so cute and brown too. I really like that new pattern. All right, here we go. We have our futuristic screen, our fut futuristic table, and we have five gotcha tickets. Volume eight is a new pose and a new pattern thingy. Picture frame. I don't really take pictures as much in this game anymore. I don't think I, re I really have a reason that much, so I don't really use them, but they are cute. Some of them. Some of them. This one is kind of nice. All right, so this is pop-up area material and your world. So let's do the pop-up area first, I guess. First one saying, send a stem to an item with a blue star. So we don't even have to like it, but we can just say nice. And then we have to like an item. So I'll take the, um, what should we do? I really want to get items I would actually use, but oh, oh. Up. Oh, the dress. It's the dress. Yes, perfect. Okay. Then we have to do two world items. So we're going to your world. So here, I'm just going to go to profile because we have to follow someone in your world. Profile, follow. I don't really know this person, so I'm just going to unfollow again. And the other one is in the stamp. So once you're still in this menu, you just say nice. And that is it's good enough. And this one's already done. There's not that much styling on this one. Here we go. This one is in love and our pose tongue out. That's kind of a cute pose. I like that better than the than the double guns, right? And we have 30 keys, which is quite generous. Then we have the first of our jackets for the A-type and then 50 keys or I wish 50 keys, 50,000 points and then 10 tickets. It's a little bit more generous. Again, this one is just really, really short. So first up, we have to set a new item in the item box, which has been a minute for me. So I'm going to choose the dress that I made. Look, I made two colors. I made a pink one and a an orange one. Let's do the pink one for this. Next up, send the stamp to an item marked with a blue star. Uh, just any of them, but we also have to like one. So let's at least find someone thing that I would use, even though I've already had all of these. All right, we'll just say nice on the jacket and then follow music, create the item. So profile, follow. Oh, look, it's a little rice ball cat. That's cute. And then lastly is a like an item. So, oh, I already like this one. <laughs> we'll like that one then and that is done that was too fast honestly but at least it makes it easier for people who don't have a lot of time to play so here have our oversized subculture style jacket 50 points and our tickets great volume 10 is oh what's that it looks like lenses i don't think i have orange lenses so probably that one or it's makeup but that'll be very subtle once again this one has no styling at all <laughs> unfortunately it's kind of boring but we have to talk to a player muse or at least do some stuff so let me go back follow a player you met in a cocoon so let's follow her There's a little following going on here there we go follow unfollow let's set a stem to a player muse on the same menu once again if it feels very repetitive at this point i'm sorry if <laughs> it's not that entertaining i was thinking we'd get more styling this time send a look at request from someone in your world that's the first time we've had that so far and it's 
we're like at 10 right now or something like that. All right, we're just gonna press X here and then send a look at request and then send a stamp to someone in your world. So we'll just send the same person a stamp. That's that already. It's a little bit soon, but okay. And we have our lenses. Okay, so I think they're supposed to be like holographic something going on. Mm, I don't know if I like them. Maybe not my favorite. Then next up, we have another pair of the ATAP socks and then a blue version of the cherry background that we had and 100,000 points. I wish the money, like the e-points would mean more to me, but I have so much e-point that I can never use that up. I'm always over like the 40, 000, 40 million points. So I don't know what to do with all of that. I don't know. Like an item worn by a player muse. Uh, oh, we'll take the shoes actually. Oh, they're not the new ones. Well, whatever. We'll take the shoes. Then we have to do two character muse outfits and two player muses. And then we have to send a stem to all items. You know what? I think actually they made the first like, because I think we have most of the outfits already of the items, because now we're just going to get the duplicates. They make that run really easy to complete. And then if you want like the double items, you have to style a little bit more. And that's why from now on, we're probably going to get a few where we have to style like four people right now, right? I think that's the mindset, which is pretty nice. Again, for people who don't play that much and people who play a lot. So let's start off by making a player muse outfit here. Pink anything boots unique. Okay, let's see if we have anything pink that is inspiring me. We can do one of these sweaters because these are really cute. It doesn't really match our hair though. Like I don't, not the biggest fan of the hair with pink, but we can work with this. And this one with sneakers. And I'm thinking like either like, do we have tennis skirts in this game or is it something different? Or it's called pleated skirt, right? Let me try that if I... Do I have that? You're telling me I don't have a white pleated skirt that is super short. I guess this one can work. Kind of surprised I don't have it. Oh, this one works. It has a cute little rim on it. Yeah, the outfit kind of clashes, but I'll, I'll give her what she is requesting here. I actually kind of hate it. Let's do shorts instead. It looks better. I want it to be a little bit more casual than that. Like, it's cute casual. <laughs> With a big butt, I feel like it's a bit extreme, but this one is like more realistic. I think if you would see someone out that's like wearing a sweater with jean shorts, right? All right, this is our first player muse done let's do another player muse oh she's back actually I do then her first looks elegant no not again you're gonna get a full elegant look which is the heels one of the like this is like a teacher's look right like it's giving like history teacher or something like a vest like that i don't think many people can pull off yeah not my favorite fit whatever moving on <laughs> at least i styled it right all right this is another player muse we can style white anything anything cool so to me that means it's just a cool look especially if they have anything anything that kind of means like like from fashion dreamer etiquette especially if they say anything anything that white means like any color so i'm gonna sell to that let's start off by choosing a jacket i think i have like a few cool colors for this one like i have a lot of powerful jackets but I'm, I'm willing to give up like a hundred space <laughs> for just the powerful jacket especially when we get the three colored one which is also still to come so let's use this one and i don't think we have black leather dresses do we like just that black mini dress that isn't cutesy like the sweater one or actually the dinosaur one is even better see that's cute and then some combat boots in i guess a cool color mm, that's cute i'm sorry i'm just falling in my own stereotype again with the puffer jacket and with these shoes but it just looks so like these are my three favorite items i'm looking at it the one in the outfit looks good and then we'll do the uh oh the zombie socks look cute with this or the stitch uh, one maybe a beanie with it do i have yes i do that's a cute fit that's cute and it's cute because i use my favorite items i'm sorry i get a free pass for like three outfits to use all of those together so whatever all right that one is done now we have to do one more character muse yes perfect sell my item we'll do a b-type don't worry but we're getting to one. Oh, we can do the new one i really like the new items because it's something fresh to look at oh we have to style the pants oh well, i don't know orange let's do an orange look there's not much styling you should do the top is cute it has more detail i feel like than some of the other b-type items we're matching it orange isn't that cute all right that is also done uh i think this is it and our reward we have the socks again blue background and 100 e points volume 12 oh yeah i told you it was gonna be matching this is the other side but then in purple and when we have the green socks again we got in like the first one right, we have to do three player muses and then like stuff in the uh 
in the pop-up area. So I'm gonna do that in a minute. Let's do the styling first because it's more fun. Light blue, anything, anything cute. Whoa, they're full on light blue and white. Let's see if I can match that with the hair too. I love it when people commit to something like that. It's very um, cinema roll, you know? Uh, I want it to be cutesy, so I want to do a dress. I have any cute ones. Let me see first. I don't want to use this one again, but I won't. Oh, we can do a fairy dress. I haven't used those in like a hot minute. Oh, but... <laughs> It's too good not to- I'm sorry. Fairy dress can wait. It's too good not to use. Or did I just not make this outfit? I think I just made this outfit. I think I just did. Thanks for reminding me. <laughs> wait, okay. We'll do the fairy dress. That's also cute. And then do I have fairy shoes with that? Mm, it's not really matching. We can do the other jeweled one from the wedding set. I don't really think I have any- Oh, I wouldn't say any magical jackets, but of course we have the wings, right? So many blue ones, yet nothing matches in the shade. All right, we could do this one, but I'm gonna see if I have white uh, in a second. Let me do, let me do the crown. A very magical look, if I say so myself. A sort of white outer jacket. Oh, this is way better. Oh, this matches. I really hope they like this. It's more of a little bit of a green undertone, so maybe not exactly what they want, but we'll see. Cute fit either way, and we get some points in return. Okay, that is good. And now two more player muses. Oh, she's really cute. Let's see, white anything anything cute again just a cute look but the color doesn't matter all right i'm thinking again i'm so dressy today what kind of dress are we feeling are we feeling the wedding dress is that, that's not really cute that's more elegant right long dress we just use a different color version of this actually we can do oh this matches her hair so cute okay let's do that and then maybe some red lolita shoes if i have something like it probably mm, flats the fluffy heels like these that's really cute or the boots oh <gasps> yeah the boots we just got wait that matches perfectly and then some sort of like i think there's strawberry socks we have the card ones the card ones are cute too parade socks mm, we have a bunch of different ties i don't know if i want to do pink oh that one is really nice i think i like this pattern the most so let's just go with oh here's the strawberry one. Oh, we can use the undo button <gasps> This is cuter. Okay, perfect. And then I want to do the hat with the strawberry on it, I I guess. Ooh, the bow's even cuter. That's a cute look. I don't I haven't really styled my own character in that like full Alita wear, like the big bow and the big dresses and everything, the whole coordination, but it's pretty cute. It matches her hair so well. It looks really nice. All right, on to our last a look it for the player muses. Let's see if there's anyone over here. This person in the back can use some styling. Cause a jean jacket with a gown. I don't know, girl. Green plaid anything or accessory cute green plaits all right we can do like a green theme let's do this with uh oh, oh, oh. make sure the greens don't clash because greens clash so easily i don't know what's up with green with that <laughs> if it's not the same shade normally it looks like really bad but the skirt top works let's find a jacket that goes with this oh i haven't used this one in a long time that actually looks kind of nice but maybe a different pair of skirts like i like it but maybe Maybe a white to like kind of liven up the look a little bit. Double pattern does look kind of weird. Ooh, the, see the white skirt looks really cute with this one. All right, I was right. Look, I have so many versions of the skirt. And I don't even have a fully white one. Same as with this one. Yeah, we'll just use the skirt I have right now. And then some green shoes. Did she want green? Yes, she did. Okay. <laughs> so like I did imagine that, did I? I mean, the sandals match exactly with the top. That's really cute. It's a full summery look. And then for a headband, something either green green but that one doesn't match so let's just do the the new white one it's like the beige you want to add a little bit more detail in there that's cute and it matches all the three things that she asked for so that was really well done. We've done all the look at stuff now. Now we have to go back to the pop-up area. There's no items for me to like anymore. I've already liked everything that I wanted. Oh, I'm gonna have to like other items now. All right, let's just do this one again, I guess. Like this one, send a stem to an item. So we'll say nice and then follow a muse who made an item. So we'll just follow this person. Whoa, they already have the shoe pattern and they're only that level. They have, must have been really lucky then. And we are done with this one as well. I think the next one was probably 
probably gonna be a lot of styling too. But here we have rip calf socks and the other photo frame and then 10 tickets. 13 is the shorts again, points and keys. I don't think the rewards are gonna be that interesting from here on, but we're gonna finish it anyway because we really want that hair and that hair is gonna be really good once we get it. So we have to style two players and two characters again. So let's move on. Let's go do hope now. A little change of scenery, if you will. Like an item worn by a character muse and send a stem to a player muse in a cocoon. So let's do that first before I forget. And I guess we can style her. Black anything accessory cues. Hmm. I'm kind of feeling like black wedding dress. Do I have that? I do. Why do I have so many? Look at that. Oh, I have five versions. That is too much. Okay, full black looks the nicest, I think. That is kind of embarrassing. I really have to sort everything out. All right, we'll do some simple heels because you do want to be comfortable in your wedding funeral. Headbands. Yeah, we can do the flower. Earrings as well. We'll do the coffins to make it look like more gothy. Is that what she wants? She wants cute. She wants cute. Cute, like, wedding funeral. I mean, it matches the, the tag. I don't know, objectively, I would say this is a cute look. Again, I think this dress is more elegant, but what do I know, right? Player muse has been done. Then we have to, like, an item will buy a character muse. Ugh, those have the ugliest stuff. I guess I'll take the top, whatever. All right, and then we have to style them too. Looks unique. Unique. I don't know, girl. The dino. The dino top. Let's go from, let's go from there, right? I think some pants, but I want to do long pants on this one. Do we have any? Oh, that's kind of cute. I know it's double pattern, but it kind of works. Am I lying? <laughs> Or the new pants that could also... Oh, the brown one probably look really cute. Oh, that looks good with the hair too. And then I want to say sandals so bad. You know what? Let's do it. Right? I like it. And then maybe a hat. But I think that hides the hair and I kind of like the hair. Yeah, let's not do a hat. That's cute. Pants with the shoes and the... The colors just work together, I think. All right, we have another character muse done. Let's move on to our next person. Ooh, my character's hair split kind of weird in the middle. Can you see that? Probably separate those girls. Yeah, that looks better. Okay, good. Next up, we have our other player muse. Whoa, I love that look. It's giving um, oh, what's that style called? You know which one I'm talking about? The the 2000 um Japanese fashion. What's it called? Whatever. Purple any animal anything cute. I got you. I have some. I have the that dress that's gonna match perfectly. Yeah, wait, 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 wait. It's that leopard print long dress that I have like in 100 shades because it's so cute. Either this one or the dark purple one, but I kind of like the light one. It's so cute. It's not purple, but it's gonna, it's, it's matching the style that they're probably going for if it's if it's what I'm thinking it is. I just forgot the name. What is it called again? Yeah, I can't, I can't, I can't think of it. Uh, for shoes, we can do heels. I kind of think that's cute on this one. I wish we could add it back because I would have a little off the shoulder thing or like a shoulder bag but it's not happening i'm just gonna match it with pink headband and it's like a simple look okay also i would add a necklace and oh, i want to say earrings but i could have done that one it does match the tones that they asked for. It's so cute. I really want to dress like that in real life, man. Okay, now lastly, we have to do one more character muse, which should be like right here. Use purple tones. There's a lot of purple requests. I think it's like the third or the fourth one we've had so far. But that's cool. That's cute. Wait, with this one. Black leather skirts. Wait, 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 wait. This but then tight. I don't know. The one with the zipper. That's cute. And then black pumps or something. <gasps> Yes, yes, yes. Okay, and then also, um, um, oh, the, oh, the jean jacket, yes. Or the puffer one. No, I like the jean jacket. That's cute. That's a fit. <laughs> that is a fit. I don't know how I was, if I would like that in real life. That's cute. Look at that. And we got three stars. Let's go. And we have our next fair thing done. So let's claim our rewards real quick. There we go. We have another pair of the shorts. We have money and we have keys. 14. We have a different shade of the background and then the B-type pants again. I think the other one were purple, right? And this one is blue. So we have to style three players. Send a stem to a player in a cocoon. Is that Naruto? <laughs> is it? Or is that the Dragon Ball Z guy? I don't watch anime. I'm sorry. I think it's supposed to be someone. That's funny. All right. So we have to send someone a stem. So that's done. Like an item worn by a character muse. We'll take your sweater if I haven't done so already. Let's go. And like an item worn by a player muse. I kind of don't like this. I'm sorry. I know it's supposed to be someone, but let's do her shoes. If I don't have that, I think I probably already do. No, I don't. Okay, perfect. That's also done. So now it's just back to styling. Orange plaid sneakers elegant. Sneakers and elegant and orange. 
You're trolling. Oh, it is a B-type. Well, I guess you're getting this one. <laughs> That's the same look we just made. It just happens to work out with orange again. But then this time we're going to have Panted R matching because the other ones didn't really work, I think. Yeah, I guess it's black, <laughs> black shorts. Girl, I don't know. It's interesting. I think it's supposed to be... Oh, I'm not even going to guess because it's embarrassing because I don't know any character names, man. Moving on to our second player muse. Oh, this one has a refresh. Let's go back and down. Oh, she's wearing those pants. That's pretty cool. Green anything, anything unique. Just a green look. I'll make it unique. Don't worry. If I have any new green items, that's... Ooh. Mm, we could do this dress again. I kind of like that. Or... Wait a minute. This is cute. I kind of like that, actually. But maybe we can do some different colored socks to kind of switch up the, the look. Some full on tights. Yellow. I find this interesting. I don't know what... Uh, I, I can't really style it. I'm not good with it. Ooh, the pink kind of works with this. It's cute. We have glasses too. I don't know if I want to do headwear, but with a green or a pink headband. Again, the, the color sandwich theory really works here too. Because of pink, pink, green, green. At least I think at least. Like you can't disagree with me here, but I think that was pretty cute. Now we have to style one more real person. So let's walk all the way to the back. You can pass. And here we have... Wait, that's from Scooby-Doo. What's her name? That is so cute. People are doing cosplay now. That is so cute. What's her name? Daphne? Is it? That is so cute. Pink anything accessory cute. I also, I also don't want it ruin the outfit. Damn, people do cosplay and everything. That's so nice. Let's do a dress. And then once again, one we haven't used yet. Oh, this one is so cute because it comes with a neck. Oh, it looks so good. We're going to do it. We're going to do it. We'll do pink shoes though. Platforms or something like that. Sneakers look kind of off with this one. Because pink and red and white look so cute together. Yeah, these are fine. And headwear. We can do the bejeweled bow. I don't think a jacket will look good, but we can try it, right? Blazer. It works, but I don't like the shape of the jacket. This is cuter. Like, it's a little bit dressed for colder weather, but it's still cutesy. See, pink and red? Pink and pastel red, per se. Don't do neon red with that. Or pink. That's cute. And I think we are done already. And we have our second pair of pants. The blue in love. And we have 100 points. 15. The, the B-type jacket again. Keys and gotcha. 45 keys is pretty generous, honestly. But they added some new items that are really expensive, so I guess it makes sense. All right, like an item worn by player muse, follow player coordinated all items of an outfit. All right, let me go back to this guy. Oh, I can't view the outfit because I just made it. Oh, this is a cute little look. Let's view the outfit. Say view, profile, and follow. That is all good. Send a stem to all items for coordinated look. All right, this is also done. And like an item worn by a player. I don't know, it's a pretty basic item but I guess I'll take the dress. And then all we have to do is style three player muse. So let's start off with her. Black anything dress kimono cute. So let's use another like Lolita type dress, but then I guess in black, she's going for like the whole gothic look. So I kind of want to go with that too. I'm gonna be honest, this one is not my favorite. I think I prefer this one. Ooh, or the witch one. The witch one looks really cool. gothic -y shoes. Just black ones. This one's pretty easy to style. Headwear. Oh, we can do the witch hat. Finish the whole look. You don't really see earrings, so I don't really want to bother. And again, I would add like a bat shaped purse with this one. That'd be really cute. But one day, <laughs> one day. And we got some rewards. Moving on to our number two. Let's just go to the one here in the back. Her fit is so cute. I love that dress so much, but it's getting a bit too warm for that. Pink fruit dress kimono cute. I don't think I have a fruity dress, but we can do pink. Pink or red. Once again, have we used everything here yet? I think we just did this one, right? So I don't want to... Have we... Ooh, the Ellis dress is cute. Oh, they're asking for pink, but whatever. <laughs> My rules, my look, whatever. Okay, the red. I want to do boots if I have some cute ones, but I don't think I do. Like the Uggs do. <sighs> Girl, no. And yeah, we'll just do like these bow ones. I'm feeling very coordinated looks today. So either one color, a full on Lolita today. I don't know what's up with that. Ooh, these are cute with the hearts, like subtle. I love these look well with them, but we're going to go for the hearts. That's fine. And we need, of course, a hair accessory, which would be a big old bow in red or the bunny ear i don't know no this is fine this is fine again bag would be a must honestly but here we are now we all only have to style one more person and then we're done with almost our last here it looks like a little bear outfit it looks like pom pom purin no that's probably not pom pom purin we've chosen a different hat that's cute oh the jean jacket wait let me grab 
<laughs> Let me grab the jacket before it's gone. I don't think I have a gray one. Again, I'm too lazy to craft them myself. At this point, I'm just getting other people's stuff. Blue, anything, anything cute. What are we feeling? Let's check outerwear first because I want to make a little bit more of a layered look for this one. I mean, this is their jean jacket, but maybe it'll be fun to style their jean jacket for them, right? So either blue or white for the top and then we'll check bottoms. None of these are really screaming out to me if i'm honest oh this one is cute though because her look originally looked very casual like like a real life look so i kind of want to imitate that i hope it's not going to be too similar skinny jeans or is that too blue <laughs> i kind of like it though oh the skirt this is very like tumblery <laughs> i like that way either black or white shoes because that matches the skirt platforms eh. mm -hmm. wait a minute wait a minute wait a minute wait a minute and then the the hat because this one doesn't hide the hair Ooh. It's not blue, but that is a really cute look. <laughs> it doesn't match any of the tags they requested, but I feel like it matched the vibe that they were wearing, so maybe they'll like it either way. Yeah, I like that. These are like almost all new items. No, they're not. Just the hat and the <laughs> and the jacket, but still. And our rewards, the jacket again, key tickets and keys. On to the last volume. Okay, so we have to make a look at her player muse three times again. Send an item with a blue star in the item box. I'm gonna do those first so we can do the styling like less. So we just say nice on an item. That's done. Then like an item will buy a character and buy a player muse. So let's see if there is perfect. Two people here. Ugh. Mm. Mm, I wouldn't use any of this. I don't know. Let's do the earrings then, I guess. It's the most versatile here. And buy a player muse. I don't really need any of this. Especially the black eye. I'm sorry, I can't do it. I can't do it. I keep collecting the black eyes and I have to delete all of them. Let me just move on here. Let's see. Anything better? Ugh, not really. Uh, I'll take the ear. Oh, I already like the earrings. Oh, oh I don't like the top either. No, I can't do it. <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna keep walking here. Better, I guess so. The jacket. Perfect. And now we have to sell through people and then our, our, we're done. Red, anything? Okay, nice. I don't think we've made a red look so far. That's exciting. Let's have a look. She wants simple, so I'm going to try not use any patterns. Oh, this one matches the hair so well. Wait, I don't know if red on red will look good. Does it? Maybe. You know, if we go full on red, especially with the hair, we might make this work. Right? I don't know. And then for the socks, I do want to do tights. But what if we did like black tights or something? I don't know. Is that too much pattern? Oh, the rose one works as this one works really well wouldn't be complete without headwear do i have any red bows yeah again this is a small one just a little subtle the choker is only like black part here well i guess with the sole of the shoe so i guess that works but cute all right this one done i think we have to do two more something like that already forgot honestly oh she has a cute fit oh this is a super low score i'll give her some good items white anything anything cute wait maybe it's the second account because she knows it i'm feeling this top right here because that's cute and white i think they might actually want a full wide look so let me try and see if i can even pull that off without making it look bad because a full wide look sometimes is kind of difficult because if you tuck in the top on this one i feel like it looks too much like an undershirt like this works and then maybe if we do a pink like super pastel pink jacket if i have something like that oh that's actually kind of cute wait 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 wait, wait. the pink pink shoes what about pink sneakers oh i love that <laughs> I love it when I make accidentally like really good looks because I never, well, I mean, I mean to, but it just happens so easily sometimes with the pink, let's do the pink bunny ears just like to spice up the look a little bit. That's so cute. All right, we only have to make one more look and then we're done. Well, I mean, we're going to style my character, don't worry, but then we're done with the fair already. I feel like I go faster and faster each time I'm doing these. All right, last person here. Black, anything, anything. No, I don't want to do that. Sorry. <laughs> I don't want to do that. We're asking here, light blue, anything elegant. Okay. Well, what are we thinking? light blue i kind of don't want to do a dress right now so let's see if i let's try and style this one because i don't think i've ever used it and if i don't use them i'm just gonna get rid of all the color versions that i have because if i can't make it work then what's the point in having them right and we, you don't want to do like really long pants which could be hmm? i don't hate that yeah i think i'm gonna go with this actually <laughs> that was pretty easy and for shoes again i need something blue and elegant i would do heels but i feel like open toes underneath jeans look kind of weird oh these are the jeans with the stripe on it wait i have to change that those don't those are not elegant at all all right this one works better yeah i like the shade but this the thing on the side just doesn't work for me we'll do the dark blue jeans and then for shoes again i don't want to do open toes with the with jeans because i feel like this that's just wrong <laughs> i don't know but if we 
do heels like this, it does work for me. Like she's kind of like casual chic or something. Hardworking lady on her day off with a pearl headband. Boom, done. That was our last look at for the future fair. That is so fun. Let's claim our last rewards. That was too soon. I don't know. Then we have our subculture jacket. We have our tickets and the keys. And now we are getting our hairstyle. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. And here we go. 75 keys. Pigtails with cat headphones. I'm kind of heartbroken that it's connected to the hair. They didn't have to do that, if I'm going to be honest. And tickets. And that's it. It's kind of sad that the pizza barely got anything. They got, what did they get? Socks, shorts, and a top. That's it. All right, let's, let's, let's make a new look. Let's start off with the hair, I think. Let me change my item first to anything that I got. But I think I only found tops from the, uh, from the new event. I don't think we got anything else new. So let me just put on the... I don't know which one. Let's do the black and white one to be more casual on this one. And then for bottoms, I'll just put it on short so it looks like she's just wearing a sweater. That's cute. Okay, fine. Let's go to the pop-up area. Oh no, the saloon. So our new hairstyle is right here next to the other pigtails. <gasps> I like it so bad, but I... Okay, just a small criticism. Why can we not change the bangs on this one? Like, I get that they all want to do different hairstyles, but when it comes to this one, we're probably not going to get different versions. If you don't have bangs, you might not want this. Like, why is there not a selection option that side bang, side bang, normal bangs, no bangs, just fringe? Like, why is that not an option? Like, I get it for the other ones, I guess. It's kind of unfortunate. It's too locked on one thing. But, all right, we'll change in a second. But we also have the new eye color. Let me find it. It is a right here. It's green. It's so cute. Okay, let's change our hair to look like miku like i said i don't watch anime but i'm the biggest miku fan i love miku her eyes are a little bit more bluish but it's fine it's fine it's fine, fine i have most colors unlocked so i think oh this is definitely miku miku green and then for her headband or headphones so her hair pieces have like a pinkish in it but the main color is going to be like a gray so i'll do the accents colors in like the pinkish i have it something like that i wish the selection slider was different it's kind of difficult to navigate because there's so much to scroll through right is this miku color maybe i want to make him a little bit darker gray do i have anything darker gray all right i did it i think i did it at least right does that look good i think it looks good all right you can disagree with me if it doesn't but don't tell me at least okay let's make a jacket because i'm feeling like i'm feeling it today so if i can pull it off however because i don't know if i can so depending on which miku you look at her main coat is either white or gray but i feel like we already have so much gray going on i want to do it white oh we have another slider again come on stop it we can do this one like a, a teal do i hate this or do i love it i don't know i feel like the teal color is kind of off I don't, i'm so bad at doing these sometimes i, I always feel it like in the moment and then when i'm done or like am i editing or something i don't see it and i'm like uh should have changed it i'm kind of scared but we have two blueprints so does it really matter that much let me check my green palettes here i don't have that many it's too specific like i don't feel like i would use this Let's use the uh, color randomizer. Ooh, this one is cool. Ooh, in pink. I kind of like that. Let me let me let me change this a little bit, right? I'm kind of tempted to do it, y'all. I think I'm gonna do it. Let's do it. I really hope I won't regret this. It's cute though. I don't think I want to do the shorts right now, but we can do the socks, maybe. Or maybe it's not the most Miku color. Okay, so the band-aids are sliders for whatever reason. I don't know. Oh, I kind of hate it. I regret it. I'm not gonna do this. I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna craft it. I'm sorry. Oh, I don't know if I like the shade of pink I use. Let's just put it on and then just like style an outfit. I'm, I'm too scared to use the other bloopers. I hate the feeling. It's like that sticker fear I have of not use, wanting to use stickers. It probably look cute with this fit though, right? It works with this fit. I don't hate it. There, I said it. Hate it, love it. I don't care. This is this is gonna be it. We'll also put it at the hot box item because I haven't seen many people craft it yet and hopefully it'll do well so I can get a bunch of likes and the money. So this is the final look. Look, do we like it? I really like the hair. Overall, let me know down below what you thought of this whole event if you're excited. I'm kind of really sad about the ears being like its own thing because it would be fun if that was a blueprint, but at least I can make like a hundred different versions now without being worried about it. So that's pretty cool. Again, if you want to see me do the showroom, I will be doing this Saturday on stream. So make sure to check in and say hi. I'll also be styling some people probably. If you haven't already, please consider subscribing or becoming a member. And I hope you have a great day and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.